how to add social media icons to your WordPress site. Most modern themes do actually have social media icons pre-built in to the theme itself. As you can see, these social links, social media icons, are generated automatically by the theme itself. I'll show you how you can do that too, if your theme supports that um, functionality. When you log into your WordPress dashboard, simply press on Appearance, press on Menus. Usually you can locate the Socials menu and then provide a custom link pointing to your social media profile. So that's one way to get there. Another way to get there usually is by pressing on Appearance, Customize for the theme. So if you select the menu option, make sure you save the changes at the end. So when you're customizing your theme, uh, menus, social menus, and here you can do all sorts of things, as in add your social media links here, and if the theme supports it, it's going to go ahead and create social media icons automatically for you. Now, what if you're wanting to, let's take a look at this, have something like this, as in social media sharing buttons. Then, you can definitely check out plugins, because there are many different ones. Simply press on plugins, add new, and here, if you were to simply search for social media sharing plugins and so on, there will be plenty. There is a platform called Shareholic, whereby you simply create an account, add a site by providing your domain name, your domain name, example give the site name select the platform in our case it will be wordpress content category depending on your website's theme and the language itself so you can utilize shareholic the options shareholic makes available is plentiful you need to spend that 5 10 15 minutes tweaking how your social media sharing buttons will look but you can simply search for shareholic plugin and install it once you create your account because once you install and activate the plugin and tweak the settings according to your wants then the plugin itself will generate share buttons on your wordpress you can choose it to have it on your blog posts, your pages, and so on. You can even have that Shareholic plugin um, display ads to monetize your blog if you want, or you can disable it. Finally, I'll show you another method, which is manual. So you can add these links manually as well. And that's exactly what I've done on Rank Your Blog. Now, for you to be able to do that, keep in mind this is an advanced topic because you will need to insert some code into your WordPress theme. You surely would back up your theme and any files you edit. Pressing on Appearance and pressing on Editor should reveal the theme files that is making your theme work. And usually single.php makes your blog posts to show. I'll show you my local copy because then it'll make more sense. Where are, where are we? Okay, content single, let's press on this. As you can see, I've created a div and inserted certain information for YouTube, for Google+, as well as Twitter, and Facebook. You can pause this video and take a look at this code. 
So I've shown you many different ways to add social media icons or links for sharing and so on for your WordPress site. In either case, for your blog to grow, you need to create the content as I've shown you in Rankia videos and encourage your website visitors to share your blog posts because when you do that, then you can really, really grow your online business. I thank you very much for learning with me. If you benefited from this video session, please do give it a like and share it. And I'll talk with you in the next video session.